hello guys welcome back to my channel today i'm going to show you how you can make the session destroy immediately after one minute of creation so without wasting time let's get started in this video i am going to be using the same form which i had made in one of my previous video you can see that video to understand how to make the session first this is my project folder which I had made in that video. First of all, in your config.php file, define a constant. This is the name of the constant. And this is its value, which is our current URL of the project. Now, create a folder called inc. Under this folder, create a file called checksession.php. Let's write code for this page. I have created a session called email after a successful login. So we will check that session is created or not. Include this file in your user.php. This file will appear after the successful login. As our check session file is under inc folder, that's why I have used this folder name here. Basically, this is the path of your checksession.php file. Let's test this code. As you can see, our session has been created successfully and our checksession.php file is also included and working fine. Now, create a div with id destroy below this body tag. I will explain the usage of this div tag later. This code means, if our session has not been created, then we will be directed to index.php. Let's write the ajax and jquery code for this page. First, create a variable called destroy. Next, create a function called session destroy. This code means using set interval function after every 5 seconds page will be redirected to session destroy.php using ajax request. This is the ajax code. Now let's create this file under inc folder. Include config.php file here also. Go to login.php. After this session, create another session which holds the email session creation time. I am creating the session called start here. Before continuing this code, we have to go to our database and need to add another column called status in our user table. After login code, we will set the status to 1 immediately after the login success code. Let's go to session destroy.php file and continue our code. Now 
This denotes the current time. This code means when the difference between current time and start name session is greater than 60 seconds which is 1 minute then a query will run which will set the status column to 0 and email session will get destroyed. This success message will pop an alert message and after confirming it page will redirect to site URL. Let's test this code. As you can see, status has been updated to 1 after successfully logged in. Now let's go to our editor and activate our session destroy function. Call this function. And now let's see our code is working or not. Let's wait for 1 minute. As you can see, our session has been destroyed automatically after one minute and status is also set to zero, means our code is perfectly working. Similarly, convert the minutes to seconds to increase your session destroying time. Like for five minutes, write 300 seconds here. So this is it for today guys, if you like this video, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. Bye.